Osiris, you seeing this? Perimeter defenses tripped. They've never done that. I don't think Clovis is trying to kill us, but... Could be anything. We should keep our distance until the Guardian locks a transmat signal for us. LZ's a little hot. Got you as close as I could without blowing us all up. An outcome we all applaud. It appears your grandfather is under siege. Mm -hmm. He elicits that sort of reaction. Clovis is in danger, so is our mission. It's not right. The perimeter towers aren't accepting my credentials. Perimeter defense is zeroing in on you. Find some cover. For a second, how Salvation hacked Clovis's firewall. Maybe the Vex, but he'd implode the lab before suffering the indignity of losing it. If that is even a remote possibility, we cannot miss our only chance at restoring the war mind. Yeah, I'll try to let him know we're coming so he doesn't do anything stupid. A cryptolith? It cannot be. Zebu Arath has been avoiding Europa. Why move into Aramis's territory now? Root them out, Guardian. Leave only their ashes. Wayne. It must not be fully established. Nice to have an easy solve. I still can't raise Clovis, but I've got the doors to the sublevels open. Wrathborn made from House Salvation stock. It's fate. Uh, if they nailed to the witness, this is a logical step. I don't know. Are Zebu and Aramis not allies working towards the same cause? An opportunity, maybe. Aramis doesn't strike me as the type to tolerate subjugation. <laughs> that acolyte's glowing? Oh, please tell me that thing's not a bomb. Incited you! Slay them all! That is alarmingly loud! Bring the Zebo! 
Hive's presence is an omen. There is more to this than we know. I'm getting that feeling myself. You sound worried. Even a single cryptolith provides Ibuar Ra's influence enough to worry. Don't wait long. Clovis may be in danger, and more tomb ships flood Europa's sky every second. Then let's not give them any time to pin us down. Labs protocols are cannibalizing each other. Cryptoliths incite conflict in mind and mechanism alike. Even the sturdiest blades eventually bend to Zivor Roth's will. Wait, I think I found him. Hello? My security frames are overrun! Is another example of your overpromised underdeliver attitude? Huh. None of that sounded like. Anna, please help me. I need you. They're killing me. Ow. A simple yes would satisfy.
reset creation security protocols. Return control to me. There you are. Establishing transmat connection. Gramps, let's skip the dancing and cut to the chase. Anastasia, I'm pleasantly surprised to see you without your sister. What was it you said last time we spoke? Pretty sure it was screw you. Putting that linguistics degree to good use. Who is this? I am Osiris, Phoenix of the Dark Age, and scholar of the cosmos. I have no equal. Cute. You impertinent son of a- See? He's impossible. <laughs> we'll find another way to help Rasputin. Rasputin? The war mind is operational? Fascinating. His source code's corrupted. I don't know how to fix it, but you do. Ugh. You were always too preoccupied teaching the war mind to feel, to learn how it functioned. What don't I know? Simply everything, Anastasia. But yes, I will help you. Because you need it. And because no one else can. How uncharacteristically altruistic of you. My motive isn't complicated. <sighs> it's exhausting to watch the grains of my legacy slip through my... progeny's fingers. Self-preservation. That is simple. Partition your AI protocols onto this. I'll link you into my workshop. Then we rebuild Rasputin. Splendid. Once I am in control, all will be as it should be. The war mind will rise again. Your grandfather is insufferable. Told you. Let's get him back to the helm. Complete shell. Still, I must admit that its storage capacity vastly exceeds that of a standard exoframe. It will have to do for now. These Wrathborn present a far more pressing concern. If they can seize control of war mine technology, then it stands to reason that the Warsats are their ultimate goal. We must secure the Warsat network ourselves before it's too late. Rebuilding the war mind is now humanity's top priority. Rasputin was designed to partition itself into sub-minds as a resiliency measure. In the event of a catastrophic failure, reintegrating them into the AI core would repair the broken war mind. Most of the facilities housing those sub-minds are now defunct. A scant few remain. The Wrathborn have likely fortified their locations. Infiltrate said facilities. Retrieve the submine data from the vaults within. With the submines in hand, we can upload Rasputin to the Warsat network on board its orbital hub. I am aware that Anastasia does not hold a high opinion of me. But let it not be said that I left humanity to fend for itself.
my Corsairs whisper your name, Guardian. You have found yourself an adversary in Zivu Arath, and a cunning opportunist in Clovis. Yes, we are always watching. A protective eye to precede an assisting hand. I bring information. With Nezerak out of play, our enemies pursue a killing stroke. Aramis has yet to resurface, but in her absence, agents of Zivu Arath swarm Europa. House Salvation seems to be assisting them in despoiling Plovis Bray's installations. While I've yet to discern an exact strategy, Anna and I agree they may be trying to wrest control of the Warmind's power on the Witness's behalf. I fear they're forging inroads for an invasion. Zivu Arath's forces mobilize within the Ascendant Plain. My scouts report her hive prepare to assault the Warmind's bunker on the moon. The submine that rests there is in danger. Shape this knowledge into deathly intent for our enemies. And the war mind may yet be restored. Zivu Arath encircles your moon with sharpened blades. She strikes at a Warmind facility beneath the crust. Her armies amass within the Ascendant Plain, clawing at an ever-thinning dam. She makes no attempt to hide. That's definitely a power move. Let her brandish her weapons. We will retrieve the Submine's core before the bulk of her forces can react and leave them nothing. Today, Zivu Arath suffers a defeat.
Moving that perimeter tower to friendly. You're welcome. Mara, Zivu Arath is supposed to be a razor sharp strategist, right? She's got the numbers to win. Why doesn't she use them? The fairy one's form between the planes requires an indomitable will, and even then, it is dangerous. To transfer an army, then, would prove an impossible task. Nearly. But Keitel claims it has been done over Tora Bottle. Shipping these in from Savathun's throne world? No, these Scorn have not passed through the Ascendant plane. They were exhumed locally. are clear to move.
Vault security is getting overridden. Another crystalith? No. A dark presence tethers itself here, not Hive. It seeks connection with the subline. Guardian, you're on the clock. Knock out that security and I'll get the vault open. We need that submine core. Is all this technology weapon? Not quite. Every submine has a memory center. All this is Mala Hayati. It was Rasputin's favorite. Sort of like a protege. Perhaps this submine will be a source of answers then. Only if we seize it before the scorn corrupt it. That'll do the trick. is tethered. I cannot see into it. Go, Guardian. Waste no time removing it. Under Aramis. Risen as a nexus of Zebu's control here, to exert her will on the submine, if that's what it was doing. To defile Aramis's house. This is not an act of desperation. It is punishment, nevertheless. This victory will disrupt Zebu Arath's hold over the scorn on Luna. At least for a while. I've got Mala's core packed. Exfil incoming. Go. I still hold questions that require answers. Time will tell what they are. 